Hello Leo, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Leo, this is your reading for the month of March and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Leo, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment on below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, uh, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Coming back to this reading on YouTube, Leo, what I'm going to do is I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down, and then we'll see what is your energy, what is the energy of the person, you're thinking about you are dealing with you will be dealing with i'll also pull out some cards uh, to see what challenges and opportunities are coming towards you okay so let's see what's your energy we have five of swords then we have seven of wands nine of cups and then we have three of cups okay I had to pause the video in between because there was some kind of noise that was happening upstairs. As far as your person is concerned, we have Queen of Cups, King of Pentacles, then we have Emperor, and we have Two of Pentacles. Hmm. I'm using another deck uh, to see what are the challenges and what are the opportunities. Okay. So what are the challenges and opportunities that are coming towards you? What are the challenges that are coming towards you? Five of Wands and opportunities that are coming are Ace of Pentacles. So Leo, you might be dealing with uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Uh, I'm getting energy of Aries, also hearing Sagittarius, you might be dealing with Taurus, Virgo, if the sign pops up all the better, let's not remain fixed on the signs, uh, let me show you the cards, 5 of swords, 7 of wands, 9 of cups and 3 of cups, this is your spread for the month of March this is your person spread Queen of Cups King of Pentacles and we have Emperor and we have two of Pentacles this is your person's spread All right, Leo, what is your energy? Leo, first of all, I see like if you are in an existing connection with someone, uh, either you're getting engaged or, or you're getting married in the month of March, I see a celebration, I see a wish fulfillment over here, okay? So if you are already in a connection with someone, definitely some kind of good news is coming your way regarding that connection. Uh, for, But again, I see that during the last week of Feb or in the first week of March, there might be certain disputes with your partner. Okay, but those will be some minor, minor disputes. You don't have to worry about it. But eventually everything will be good. I see marriage happening or escalation in the relationship. Someone, either you guys are getting engaged or you guys uh, decide about commitment or you guys start living together or something. The next step is taken in this connection in the month of March. This is applicable for people who are already in a connection. If you are single, Leo okay if you are single uh, you are going to reject many people 
but at the end of march or maybe during april you're going to find someone okay i see you rejecting many people however okay and they are not going to like that that you're going to reject them i mean maybe many of them are coming towards you with a lot of hopes but you are someone who knows what your worth is you are coming across as someone who is very well aware of his or her worth especially with the 9 of cups you know that you are a wish fulfillment for many people so you are not kind of surprised that so many people are showing interest in you okay you are not surprised uh however you also might experience some inner conflict thinking about the fact that god knows when i'm going to find love i am waiting for the right person i'm waiting for mr right mrs right miss right okay and god knows when i'm going to find them so there might be some irritation there might be some inner conflict there might be some you might be in a grumpy mood in the initial first week of march okay and however eventually things will start looking positive i'm looking at the five of swords and seven of wands energy and i'm trying to understand what this energy is all about is it just confined to in a conflict or is it just confined to dispute between you and your partner or is it something else as well i'm trying to understand that i think so leo there is someone who feels threatened by your presence and whoever this person is they know you for a long time uh this can be a long term friend a childhood friend this can be someone within the family uh a sibling or someone like that or a neighbor for god's sake but i see like there is someone who is in competition with you or for all the time or for some of you this can also be an employee working for you okay they want to be like you and they end up competing you and that is kind of annoying you okay you are like you guys work for me and why the hell you are competing with me okay it's not that you are trying to suppress anyone or it's not uh, it's not that you are trying to control anyone or not allowing anyone to grow but you don't like the fact that people are trying to compete with you when especially when they are working for you or this might be uh in a work related situation say for example someone is reporting to you then there is uh, then there is one of your subordinates or one of your reportees who is kind of subtly jealous of you and wants to compete with you or all, for all the time if this is a sibling then this person derives pleasure in uh, putting you down uh, they derive some insane amount of pleasure in you know proving to the world all the time like they are better than you they always want to prove that they are better than you in fact uh, in reality you are of course any time better than them but they have this insecurity and fear within them this is someone who is elder than you if this is a sibling this is elder than you and uh, they have some insecurities and fears and they are very careful about their image they want to portray a big picture about themselves by putting you down by showcasing to the world like how you are not a good person how you are not doing things that you should be doing and something like that they always keep on finding opportunities to blame you to put you down and something like that i don't know who this person is for some of you this can be an ex as well so what i see with uh, five of swords is uh, leo that there is this negative energy who is kind of jealous and envious of you but with seven of wands i'm also getting that you are done with them okay you are done listening to their bs you are like you're going to show middle finger to them and you're like that's it i had enough of you and i see that you're going to give a dressing down to this person you're going to give a peace of mind to this person in the month of uh, march leo this, you're going to give someone a piece of your mind okay and that person will have no choice but to listen to you like a uh, like an 
I mean, uh, like a child who has done something wrong. Okay, they will have to listen like that to you, because they will know that who the real boss is over here. They know that who is real, who is fake, who is genuine, and who is not good. They know that. Whatever they are doing, that is coming out of jealousy. This can also be a neighbor, by the way, an irritating neighbor for some of you. Okay, this person might be. They they love picking up fights with you. They love. Uh, you know irritating you all the time whoever this neighbor is they are not happy with their own family members and that is why they keep on uh venting out their frustration on you okay all right now let's talk about let's talk about your person we have queen of cups king of pentacles the emperor and two of pentacles you are going to have a lot of options leo you will have a lot of options and whoever is coming towards you has a very strong personality okay they are someone who who is an achiever they are someone who has reached a top level in their life uh, surely through hard work and determination and perseverance for some of you this is a relationship with an age gap with the emperor king of pentacles i see like there is an age gap between you and this person uh, there might be a substantial age gap for some of you this can also be a, a married person with some kids or not kids like doesn't matter no kids doesn't matter but for some of you i see like there is uh, this person is a divorcee okay and uh, there is an age gap like i'm hearing 7 to 8 years at least whoever this person is uh they are your wish fulfillment they are your wish fulfillment you have uh, the criteria ready at the back of your mind leo like what kind of a person you want your previous relationships got screwed up because of immaturity because of no wisdom on your partner's side and uh, you having to take all the responsibility in the relationship and you know that you need someone who can man up woman up who is responsible mature who is going to work along with you contribute along with you and who will like you want someone who can give you that uh, you know relationship bliss you want to experience unconditional love you want to experience love and care and affection maybe all these things were missing in the past okay previous relationships were pretty much mechanical there was no affection and care things happened just because they happened okay there it happened purely on basis of infatuation there was attraction but there was infatuation and slight lust as well but the affection the genuine care okay that was kind of missing a lot and now you know what is it that you want and that is why one of the reasons i see that you're looking for a person with an age gap is because you you're kind of drawing the conclusion that yes so uh, these people have some uh, or men or women uh, of a certain age they have some wisdom they have some uh, uh, you know experience they are mature enough and they can they can fulfill what your expectations are so whoever this person is looks like they are well established they have an amazing physique okay they have a physique to die for so even if they are uh, i mean they are even if this person comes with an age gap age is just a number for this person they're going to look way 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 younger than what their current age is okay with king of pentacles i see like this person is also financially established and somehow i see that they have some kind of reputation within their community or uh, in the organization that they are working for or in the field of their expertise say for example this person belongs to the uh, to the finance industry investment banking industry so this person is is quite a popular name over there if this person is an artist in whatever i mean i don't know this person can be a musician uh, a song writer this person can be singer and they are a well known name in that industry okay for some of you this might be a youtuber and they are a well known face over there they are a popular blogger or blogger okay so they are a well known face in their community in their industry and they have made some really good amount of money by the way okay 
this person is very 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 hard working okay there might be times when you are going to complain about them that you don't have time for me but don't worry they are a genuine person you don't have to doubt this person if they are not with you they are working that's it that's it end of the story okay and they are of course they are coming across as someone who is pretty much ambitious okay with emperor and king of pentacles and that is why they are coming across as a workaholic person they also have that softer side to them which you're going to see their softer side usually during the bedtime they will cuddle you and uh, sleep and you guys are gonna travel a lot by the way especially this person will be traveling for work reasons and they will take you along with them not that uh, you don't have your own work back home but you know that is how you're gonna spend some light moments together and you will love doing that by the way so this is coming across as someone who is wise someone who is mature someone who is full of affection okay and they have a lot of nurturing energy so this is looking like a very good connection leo this is going to fulfill all of your expectations now let's talk about the challenges we have five of wands i'm telling you uh there is going to be some kind of a dispute or disagreement with someone and it's like whoever this person is who is trying to trigger you all the time or who is kind of jealous of you and wants to compete with you all the time you are done with them okay this person is has become a challenge in your life because every now and then they keep on popping up and you're so done with them <laughs> i don't know why i keep on seeing an image of a neighbor <laughs> that's pretty weird <laughs> i mean like i just saw an image where there is a lady who is standing in the window and you're doing some gardening work or i don't know what you're doing in your front yard or backyard you're doing some kind of a work and this lady shouting this neighborhood lady she's shouting from that window when talking to you in a very aggressive manner i don't know who is this uh for some of you you guys have some trouble some neighbor okay and uh so that's a challenge you are kind of tired now dealing with this person whoever this person is uh opportunities that are coming towards you ace of pentacles money making opportunities opportunity to stabilize an ongoing thing okay uh say for example you had applied for a loan and you were struggling for loan you're going to get that loan say for example you had a uh, i don't know your money stress is reducing leo okay either some there is going to be an influx of money by way of loan or by way of your own income okay and that is going to reduce the stress uh, from your mind okay All right I hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person take care of yourself have a great time ahead leo bye bye